I'm Ty Quinones and here is a look at what is happening now. A CCSD special education teacher is now facing charges after being accused of having sex with a student. The CCSD police say that it happened on the last day of class at Palo Verde High School. Michael Lloyd appeared in court where his bail was set at $10,000. The arrest stems from an investigation initiated at Palo Verde High School on May 25th, 2022. Lloyd had been a teacher with the district since January 2016. He will be assigned to home per negotiated agreement with the bargaining unit. Investigators right now, they're asking anyone with information about the case to contact CCSD police. AAA says that Memorial Day through Labor Day were identified as the 100 deadliest days of the year. Local law enforcement, advocates and car crash survivors, they're going to be meeting today to talk about ways to address the topic throughout the summer. The crash data from Metro and also Nevada State Police shows that speed plays a factor in more than 30 percent of crashes during this time of year. And since this Memorial Day weekend, of course, draws huge crowds to the Las Vegas Valley State Troopers in Nevada and California, they are cracking down on the I-15 spanning the state line starting today. Officials are promising that even the most minor traffic infraction will be enforced. It's estimated that about 45,000 cars will cross into Nevada on the 15 over the weekend. It's always so crowded coming and going from Southern California to Southern Nevada on the 15. We've got temperatures that are going to warm back to 100 for our Friday afternoon. That's in spite of a lot more high cloudiness at times today than we've seen the last few days. Also some breezes, southwest winds steady at about 20 miles per hour. Later today with the dry air that'll elevate the fire danger. 100 today, uh, we're still above average at 95 on Saturday and the gusts will range from 30 to 35 miles per hour today, tomorrow as well as Sunday by Memorial Day on Monday. Todd, big drop into the low 80s on Monday. That is quite cool for this time of late May, but we do warm up Wednesday of next week, June the 1st, and we're back in the mid 90s then. All right, Justin, thank you. As a reminder, you can always get the latest news and information on our website at KTNV.com.